So our NAV 900 is our other antenna option. Uh, we mainly aim, aim this when people are auto steer or heading towards auto steer. Um, the main difference on, in the NAV 900 over the NAV 500 is everything is built in in the one unit. With a NAV 500, if you want to auto steer with a NAV 500, we have to fit what's called a, an IMU. It's a little box that bolts on the front axle, um, which has your gyroscopes for slopes and things like that, um, whereas it's all built into the NAV 900. Um, we have different correction options available for the NAV 900 to bring your precision right down. So range point is quite popular. Um, people sewing grain, things like that, looking for a bit more accuracy. We can run three inch accuracy on range point subscription. Um, it's three inch accuracy with repeatability of up to six inches. So the repeatability is when you leave the field after one hour, one day, one week, the, the, the line could shift up to six inches. Um, it is time based. So it's if you're in the field all day long, you'll never see a difference. It's it's time based. When you leave the field, it can um, it can it can shift up to six inches. There's no point saying otherwise. Um, I suppose you, it's a bit of you get what you pay for, but you have to know that when you're buying it. And um, it's no matter what system brand you're looking at, you need to know all the ins and outs of what subscription you are buying, um, and, and find something that suits your job best. So conversion time for range point is three minutes. So when you turn on the system, it'll take three minutes to have full signal. Repeatability six inches, but your accuracy is down to three inches. So um, we would see that quite, it's very good for sewing grain, things like that. Uh, three inches holds quite well and it's a, it's a, it's a very good value subscription.